You're probably wondering how to invest in Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies. Well, you're not alone. In the realm of the digital economy, cryptocurrencies have been making waves, creating a new frontier for investment. These digital assets, such as Bitcoin, Ethereum, and many others, are decentralized forms of currency that use cryptography for security. Their allure? They have the potential for high returns. But like any investment, they also come with their share of risks. Cryptocurrencies are reshaping the way we think about money, transactions, and investments. They're not just an alternative form of currency, but also a potentially lucrative investment opportunity. As we traverse deeper into the digital age, understanding and harnessing the power of these digital currencies could be crucial. So if you're itching to dive into the crypto world, hold tight as we guide you through the steps to start investing. Before you invest, it's crucial to understand what you're getting into. Let's dive into the fascinating world of Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies. Born out of a revolutionary white paper by the pseudonymous Satoshi Nakamoto in 2008, Bitcoin is the first cryptocurrency. It introduced the world to the concept of decentralization, where power is not held by any central entity, but distributed among a network of computers, or nodes. Bitcoin operates on a technology called blockchain, a public ledger containing all transaction data from anyone who uses Bitcoin. Transactions are added to blocks, or the links of code that make up the chain, and each transaction must be recorded on a block. But Bitcoin isn't the only player in the game. There are several other cryptocurrencies, each with their own unique features. Let's look at a few of them. First, Ethereum. While Bitcoin was created as an alternative to traditional money, Ethereum was developed as a platform that facilitates peer-to-peer -peer contracts and applications via its own currency, Ether. Next, Litecoin, often considered the silver to Bitcoin's gold. Created by former Google engineer Charlie Lee, it was one of the first cryptocurrencies to come after Bitcoin, and its technical process is nearly identical to Bitcoin's. But it's faster and cheaper. These are just a few examples. But there are over 4,000 cryptocurrencies in existence today, each serving different purposes and offering unique features. Remember, though, that all cryptocurrencies are known for their extreme volatility. Prices can skyrocket in a day and plummet in the next hour. This volatility can present great potential for gains, but also for losses. It's also important to note that while cryptocurrencies can offer high returns, they are not without risks. The market is new, highly fragmented with huge spreads, which means it can be very vulnerable to manipulation. Now that you have a basic understanding of cryptocurrencies, let's move on to the steps to start investing. The first step to investing in cryptocurrencies is setting up a digital wallet. Now you might be wondering, what's a digital wallet? Well, it's a bit like a bank account for your digital currencies. It's where you'll store, receive, and send your cryptocurrency. There are several types of crypto wallets you can choose from. Online wallets are accessible from any device with an internet connection, making them convenient but potentially vulnerable to security breaches. Mobile wallets are apps on your phone, offering convenience and features like QR code scanning. Then there's hardware wallets, physical devices that store your crypto offline, providing an extra layer of security. There's a myriad of wallet providers out there. Some of the popular ones include Ledger, Trezor, and Mycelium. Each comes with its own unique features and security measures, so do your research to find the one that suits your needs. Once you've set up your digital wallet, you're ready to buy your first cryptocurrency. The next step is to choose a cryptocurrency exchange. Now, you might be wondering, what is a cryptocurrency exchange? Well, it's a platform that allows you to trade cryptocurrencies for other assets. It's like a traditional stock exchange, but for digital currencies. There are several factors to consider when choosing an exchange. First and foremost, security. You want to ensure that your investment is safe. Look for exchanges with strong security measures like two-factor authentication and cold storage. Next, consider the fees. Some exchanges charge per transaction, others have a flat fee. Ensure you understand the fee structure before committing. Finally, the range of available cryptocurrencies. Some exchanges offer a wider variety than others. If you're interested in less popular or emerging cryptocurrencies, you'll need an exchange that offers these. Remember, research is key. Don't rush into choosing an exchange. Take your time and weigh your options. 
After picking the right exchange, you're ready to make your first purchase. Now comes the exciting part, buying your first cryptocurrency. It's like stepping into a whole new world, full of potential and promise. But before we dive in, let's take a moment to understand the process. First off, you'll need to navigate to your chosen crypto exchange. This is the digital marketplace where buyers and sellers meet to trade cryptocurrencies. It's like a bustling bazaar, but for digital assets. Once you're in, you'll need to decide which cryptocurrency you want to buy. Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, the choice is yours, and it's as boundless as the digital frontier itself. But here's the beautiful thing about cryptocurrencies. You don't need to buy a whole coin. If the price of one Bitcoin makes your eyes water, don't worry. You can buy a fraction of a coin, a feature that makes this type of investment accessible to everyone, regardless of their budget. So you've chosen your coin, and you've decided how much you want to buy. Now it's time to make the transaction. This is where security becomes paramount. Always ensure that your connection is secure. Look for that little padlock symbol in your browser's address bar. That's your assurance that your transaction is protected. As you confirm your purchase, you might feel a flutter of excitement. That's normal. You're not just buying a cryptocurrency, you're investing in the future. You're becoming part of a global community of pioneers, exploring this new financial frontier. And there you have it. You've navigated the exchange, chosen your coin, made your purchase, and secured your investment. You've taken your first step into the world of cryptocurrencies, and it's a step that could lead to exciting places. Congratulations, you've just bought your first cryptocurrency. Investing in cryptocurrencies isn't just about buying coins, you need a strategy. And that's what we're going to talk about now. When it comes to crypto investment, there are two main strategies to consider, long-term holding and short-term trading. Let's break them down. Firstly, long-term holding, often referred to as hodling in the crypto community, which is an acronym for hold on for dear life. This strategy involves buying cryptocurrencies and holding on to them for a long period of time regardless of market fluctuations. The idea here is to ride out the storm of volatility in the belief that your chosen cryptocurrency will increase in value over the years. Think of it as a marathon, not a sprint. On the other hand, we have short-term trading. This strategy is more like a series of sprints. It involves buying and selling cryptocurrencies over a short period of time to take advantage of the market's volatility. Day trading and swing trading are two examples of this strategy. Short-term trading requires a keen eye for market trends, a strong understanding of technical analysis, and the stomach to handle potential losses. But whether you're a hodler or a trader, one principle remains crucial. Diversification. Never put all your eggs in one basket. Spread your investments across different cryptocurrencies to mitigate risk. While Bitcoin might be the most well-known, there are thousands of other cryptocurrencies out there, each with their own potential. And, of course, regular market research is key. Stay informed about the latest news and trends in the crypto world. Use reliable sources to understand market movements and make informed decisions. Knowledge is your greatest weapon in this volatile market. So, whether you're in for the long haul or looking for quick wins, remember, strategy is key. Diversify your portfolio, keep researching, and stay patient. Cryptocurrency investing is not a get-rich-quick scheme. It's a financial frontier that requires careful navigation. With a solid strategy, you're well on your way to becoming a savvy crypto investor. Investing in cryptocurrencies may seem daunting, but with these steps, you're well equipped to dive in. We've traversed the fascinating yet complex world of cryptocurrency together, unraveling the mystery of Bitcoin and a myriad of other digital assets. We've learned that understanding the crypto landscape is the first step towards a successful investment journey. Next, we establish the importance of setting up a secure crypto wallet. Remember, this is your digital bank, a safe haven for your valuable assets. Choosing the right crypto exchange was our third step. It's the marketplace where you'll buy and sell your cryptocurrencies, so choose wisely. Our adventure didn't stop there. We moved on to buying our first cryptocurrency, a momentous step indeed. Lastly, we delved into forming a strategic plan for our crypto investments, emphasizing the significance of research and patience. Remember, investing in cryptocurrencies carries risk, but with careful planning and research, you can mitigate these risks and potentially reap high rewards. Happy investing.